Hello everyone, this is Miss Tian Fei. Today I'm going to show you how to make little sculptures of food for a healthy plate. Now, let's get started. For the supplies, I have some model magic. You could either use Play-Doh or clay. You also need a pencil and a paper plate. If you do not have paper plate, feel free to draw a circle or just use a piece of white paper. First, we are going to divide our plate into four equal space. And then you will have fruit, vegetables, greens, and protein for each section. You don't have to write their names on the plate, but I highly recommend you do so you know where things go. Now, let's start to make some fruits. We have been working a lot with Model Magic in the past. For those of you who are new to Model Magic, it's type of air dry clay. If you have air dry clay at home, you may use those as well. Model Magic, you can mix the color for those you do not have. As you may see, I only have color red, yellow, blue, white, and black. So here, I start with my fruit section with some strawberries. For strawberries, you need two colors, red for the berry and green for the stem and leaves. Since I do not have green, I have to make some green. To mix color green, you need yellow and blue. Since yellow is a lighter than blue, you need lots of yellow than blue to mix a medium green. I made some extra green so I can use them for some other fruits and vegetables later. First, to make the stem, we're just going to put a tiny dot line on top of the strawberries. And then you can make some tiny leaves for your berries. Last, for your strawberry, we are going to use the pencil to poke some dots represent those seeds on your strawberries. The second fruit I'm making are some bananas. Bananas are mainly yellow. It may have some green here and there. So I will make three individual bananas first and then put them together. When you look at bananas, sometimes the green is not just green. You may discover some yellow mixed in the green. So here I mix my green and yellow to have this yellowish green for my bananas. Next, for my fruit section, I'm going to make a green apple. I can do red apple but since i already have red strawberries i want to use a different color so feel free to make an apple you like for the green apple besides the apple green itself i will need some brown for the stem basically you will need a little bit black mixed with red and you will have this beautiful brownish color Now I finished with my fruit section of the plate. I'm going to focus on the vegetable section. My first vegetable will be some carrots. 
Carrots need orange and green. To mix orange, you need color yellow and red. Just remember, like color green, you need lots of yellow and a little bit of the red. The next vegetable will be eggplants. Eggplants has color purple. To make purple, you need red and blue. For these two colors, you can have them equal size. It doesn't have to be one color more than the other. So have the same amount of blue and red and mix them together. After you finish the purple part of your eggplant, you are going to have some grain for the stem part of your eggplant. Last vegetable for my vegetable section will be peas in the pot. And you just need some grain to make the pot first. After the pot, you can make some tiny circle peas to put on top of the pot. Now, I move on to my protein section. First, I'm going to make two sunny side up eggs. You may make some scrambled eggs or some hard boiled eggs as any way of the eggs you like. After my eggs, I want to make a piece of salmon fish. As you may remember, salmon has this beautiful orange peachish color with some white in the middle. So to make this color, you need some white, yellow, and a little bit of red. And then you may use some white to make some really thin and line in the middle of the salmon. Mm -hmm. 
Last protein, I will make some tofu. Tofu is usually white, and I will just make two white cubes to represent tofu. Next, I will focus on my green section. First, I will make some noodles. Noodles, I choose to make those white noodles. You can just make a really long line like a snake, and then put them on your plate. After my noodles, I will make some black beans. Beans is another great resource for greens. Next one, I will make some red beans. The color of red beans are not so bright like strawberries or raspberries, so make sure you add a tiny little bit of black in there to make your red just a little bit darker. Now I'm all done with everything on my plate. I'm going to make a little cup on the side for some dairy. Personally, I really enjoy drinking milk, so I will make a cup of milk. I use blue to make a cup. So do the side of the cup first and then the bottom. After you have the cup, you may put some white in there to represent the dairy you like. You may drink some almond milk, some soy milk, some cashew milk, any milk you like. And finally, I decided to make a tiny plate put underneath my cup for my milk. Thank you so much for watching. Hope you like it. See you next time.